Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Today I am going to show you uh, if you want to add uh, some features into your application that is uh, only authenticated user can access uh, your controller or action methods uh, when you uh, run your applications uh, just like that uh, when we uh, run our applications that is user registration examples uh, so only uh, I want that only authenticated user can access that page and only authenticated user can access that application so add to must uh, some features into your startup.cs file so now close that application and uh, just open your uh, startup.cs file and add authorization filters uh, in your configure service method so just it here to add like services start add mvc core and uh, there is options and in the options you have to add these features like variable policy and in the policy you have to add a new authorization new authorization policy builder and dot require authenticated user dot require authenticated user okay dot required authenticated user and uh, dot build you have to say by using that only required authenticated user must to add in your application that is require uh, authenticated uh, authentication is required okay so after that you have to add options dot filters dot add new authorized filter new authorize filter and in which you can add the policy okay now after that you have to add it here that is add XML serialized formatter dot add XML serialized formatters okay now uh, just after adding these features into your applications when you run your application authentication must to uh, must require for access your applications like that so uh, the default page will run uh, that is the login page in your applications that is the login page you cannot access any other page in, in your application like that when we uh, run employees employees and index page there there is the only uh, authenticated must be used so just add it uh, in your authentication by login when we login it uh, the uh, you have to access uh, the detail page so there is and if you want to access only employee page when I run your ap application and another page uh, you want to uh, add uh, authentication filters so just add in your employees controller in which you have to add uh, allow anonymous attributes allow anonymous so there is no need to require authentication to access employees controller you have to see that the only home controller and any other controller require uh, login functionality but uh, the employee does not require like that employees an index page that does not require any authentication features so use allow anonymous, anonymous and in the startup.cs file add that policy new authorization policy builder dot require authenticated user dot build that option filters dot add authorized filters so thank you very much for guys for watching this video for classic video so please uh, i request you please subscribe my channel and uh, please share this video thank you very much for watching